Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Aquarius, this is a monthly love and general situationship collective tarot reading session for you, Aquarius. I hope you are well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Aquarius sign. Let us see what is happening towards your Aquarius. What is the message that is meant for you to know, ready for you to know? This is for your sign. Thank you so much for your support. This is a collective reading for the Aquarius sign. This is a monthly reading. We will pick up love, money, career, finance, and general situation for your Aquarius. Thank you so much for being here. What is the collective reading for Aquarius, please? What is the guided message for Aquarius? Full month reading for Aquarius, please. What can I get for Aquarius, please? A full month reading for Aquarius, please. You have the Knight of Swords. You could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, someone younger than you. Yeah, Page of Wands. You could be dealing with your kids, someone younger than you. I'm picking up the word brotherly or sisterly. Knight of Wands. Okay, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy again. You've got the hangman. What's coming towards you? Full month reading for Aquarius, please. The judgment card. It seems to be that you... Star card and your card is here. You're full of hope, full of wish. You got a two of cups. That's very nice. You have the knight of pentacles. And the King of Wands. Decision time, Aquarius. Let's look into your overall energy. What's the overall energy for Aquarius, please? What's the overall energy for Aquarius? Full month reading. You have the Seven of Swords. And you have the, the Page of Cups. I feel like this month there is an important conversation that need to take place, Aquarius. The Seven of Swords, the Page of Cups. If you look at the color of the Seven of Swords and the Page of Cups. If you look at the color of the Seven of Swords and the Page of Cups, it's yellow, it's bright. Um, I feel like there is a, a very big... It, it feels like a break. It, it, feel, it feels like... Um, it feels like a very, it feels like a problem, but it's just a text or a call away. You know, like a big problem. If there's a big problem, big issue, um, that can be fixed by baby step. I'm kind of getting like, you have a big problem, you've got a big issue. There's something big. There's something that has been overdue. And you would be surprised, Aquarius, because one simple text or one sorry, one message could actually clear all of the issues away. Like the first step to a big problem is a small step. That's, you know, it's, there's a big problem. There's something in here that you, you can't ignore it anymore. You know, like this month. You're kind of running out of time for some of you guys. But there is a problem. There is a person. There's definitely some sort of um, conflict in here. And up until this point, it's not been dealt with. This is something that you cannot ignore anymore. And I feel like you're going to deal with it or they're going to deal with you. And you're going to be very surprised because there would be progress in the big problem. And it would start with one small message. Like it's... It's giving me a vibe where one simple apology will just remove all of the block. Like one sorry will melt the ego. And, you know, you guys will talk again or things will be okay again. It's just one message. It's, it's a feeling where it's one message away from a solution. A big problem is one message from getting it resolved. Like if one of you will connect, the big problem, it will go away. It will be fixed. If you just connect or if they would just reply or if there would be a sorry, it would be 
no problem at all. Seven of Swords, the Page of Cups. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Oh my gosh. This is really like, if you, if one of you will make the move, then this problem, it will be fixed. You know, it's more of, it's more of a, the, the most difficult thing is the first move. That first move is difficult or that message to send is kind of difficult to compose or it could be challenging. You don't know what to ask. But I feel like it's more of an apology. Like someone, I don't think it's you. Like someone did you wrong. And to cut it short, to fix the problem, I'm just going to say sorry. And it's very sincere. And it just melts all the ego and balance is restored between the two of you and it seems to be like both of you want to reconcile or want to, to compromise so this is so there's a strong focus on that this month one small gesture one apology it just brings out a burst of sunshine and everything seems to be falling into places into like a reconciliation or um starting all over again just that message like i feel like it's going to be successful because you're going to look back and you and this person will i wish i'd have you know i wish i would have taken the steps earlier because it's going to be resolved okay so it's it's more of a discovery that something that is outstanding something that has been a recurring problem it will just be fixed by an apology or one simple step a simple step will fix a big issue and um that is gonna happen this month okay let's pick up more intuitive message for you aquarius you've got the knight of swords and the page of wands like what i said you know you've been dealing with a person or a situation where it's so complicated like it's possible that you and this person you don't see eye to eye like you guys, I feel like it's a relationship, but it's between two person. It's between two situation where you guys are not seeing eye to eye and you guys are more focused into the problem versus the solution. This month, there's going to be a groundbreaking page of wands. This is the energy that I'm talking about. That good news, someone is going to lower down their ego, lower down their pride. Someone is going to come forward to you, Aquarius, to lower down their ego, to lower down their pride, or to lower their expectation, or I don't know, maybe this person is going to unblock you, but there is someone who's going to approach you and they're open for a compromise. They're open for a conversation that would lead to a breakthrough, to a compromise, to a reconciliation. I feel like this person or this situation, it, it is the highlight of your month. You know, it's, I feel like it's a very pivotal month for you because this is a very big issue, a big relationship issue, a big problem. All of your month is going to be consumed by this because it's wanting a resolution. Could be a person, could be a project, but it's coming to an end and a solution, reconciliation, a compromise is here. There's a nine of wands. Um, there is a part of you that hesitant or somehow you're fixated to more of a no. Um, try to have an open mind. Uh, try to have an open mind, an open heart about the situation, the compromise, uh, the person. Because you, you've got here the hangman. If you keep, like, if, if you keep, like, if you stick around with the same belief or limiting belief or... If you look at the past, it didn't work out. Yeah, the hangman. If you look at the past, it didn't work out. So there's something that you need to change. And the person, in order for you guys to come up with a solution, with a compromise, or in order for this to come into a full reconciliation, if this is a relationship. Because obviously, what you're not seeing there, Aquarius, is that they want it. And you also want it, but none of you would like to move or none of you would like to change your style. You know, there's a need to, there's a judgment card in here. The center of the reading is the judgment card, which is to me, it speaks to me that you've, you've got to identify the noises. You've got to identify 
some behavioral pattern or some communication or some immaturity in here that add adds add up you know to the noises and it create more issues rather than solution so something is going to come to light and you will realize you will pick it up the the reason why this person or situation or offer keeps coming back or still around because it's wanting a solution it doesn't want to leave you it's one it's wanting to grow old in you it's wanting to stay with you it's wanting to you and this person to be flexible into a solution you know into a compromise the star card is here and this is your card you know it's it's kind of telling you have faith to because there's a part of you that nine of wands i'm tired here we go again i'm tired we're at the same cycle i'm tired you again but the universe is bringing you this so you can compromise so you can agree not to disagree so you can agree even you disagree so it's more of this is a written in the stars kind of energy in here i feel like there is there's something that the universe will nudge you or a person a situation offer will come towards you and you might you might surrender or you might just drop it off look at it one more chance i'm kind of getting like with the knight of pentacles the king of wands i know you're very tired you know aquarius you know it's been so it, it's a it's been an on and off super duper high highs and lows kind of energies in here i know it is to a point where it's it's exhausting but the universe the stun the, the hidden energy you know the the two of cups so don't get me wrong wrong i'm kind of getting like don't get me wrong it's 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 a person who comes back or an offer to it's an offer that's still around and it's it's an offer that is here it's a person it's here it's it's not it's not to it, it's not one thing to sit it's not wanting to disconnect you know one thing is for sure in here that you're missing out and the person is you guys doesn't want to disconnect in fact you guys want to connect you want to grow you want to build whatever this is that is shared and explored together it's wanting to be built up not to be destroyed so there's a compromise that you, you need to kind of focus and you're also being advised i'm coming back spend more time to think to reflect before you react because this is a wonderful opportunity. This is a this is a very passionate you know opportunity. Page of Wands. This is a very passionate person. This is a very passionate connection. You just don't see the value of it because it's been, you know, overthrown by a lot of misunderstanding, failure, disconnection, on and off, on and off. But if you remove all of the noises, the failed attempt, you would realize that this offer is still here because it's one thing a two of cups. It's one thing an agreement versus a disagreement. It's one thing to connect versus to disconnect. So I think this is one of the most, like, this is a very focal point this month. Is this relationship, could be brand, but it's a partnership. It's something that, it's been here. It's been here, you know, it's been here and it doesn't want to go. It's, it's one thing to be fixed or to be taken care of rather than to be deleted. Okay? So... This is your monthly reading. Thank you so much, Aquarius, for coming back. Thank you for your support. It's a pleasure doing the reading to you guys. I hope you've connected with me. If you do, please click the bell, click subscribe. And for all of the products, the services, the merchandise that we offer, everything is in the website. And this is your full month reading. This is Sunshine. I will see you soon again, guys. You have an amazing month. Bye-bye.